Good morning. It's Columbus. Sunday in the park with George. In October of 2023, I rode my bicycle across the state of Ohio along the Ohio to Erie Trail, or OTAT. On the first day, I rode into and out of Cincinnati, making it only 16 and a half miles down the official trail. After overnighting in a city park in Milford, I rode on the longest day of the trip, making it 82 miles to the town of London, where I was grateful to be able to pitch my hammock right by the side of the trail. Good morning, friend humans. Lucas Levy Keppel here. I'm just waking up. I was refilling the air mattress for the third time last night. Not because it was leaking air, but because the temperature kept falling, and as the temperature falls, the air shrinks within the mattress. It's very frustrating. But then I happened to look at my watch, and it was 7 a.m. I made it through the night, and now it's definitely time to get up. It feels a little late compared to yesterday, but I've only got 40 miles or so to ride today, so that's not the worst thing ever. Do some exploring in Columbus and get to stay with my aunt and uncle in Westerville tonight. Um, I'm really looking forward to that as we go. But it is currently 33 degrees. It almost got down to freezing. I am amazed that there's anything moving around, anyone moving around. But it is 7 o'clock. I'm going to get up, make some breakfast, be a little bit more leisurely this morning than I was uh, yesterday, and then head towards Columbus. Hi there. You guys have your blankets on? Kept warm during the night? That's good. So coming out of London this morning was a bit of a challenge. Followed the bypass route, which was well marked, until you get out of town. And then you're just on a rural road, and the markings to get back on the trail itself were not clear if they existed at all. I didn't see them. Fortunately, I had my GPS Garmin unit. Was able to see that I was off the trail and needed to get back on, but ended up costing me an extra mile today. I don't know, it takes a few miles for my legs to warm up to remember, hey, this is a bike, this is fine. We can just pedal and pedal and it's all good. The more I cycle, though, the more I'm impressed at the resilience of the human body. This trail is beautiful this morning. It's nice to have the sun up in the air. And to have some dappling effect from leaves overhead. There was even a rooster crowing earlier which considering it's like 10 o'clock, feels a little late to me, but you know, roosters are gonna roost.
This is the first uh, unpaved section of the trail. But it is beautiful. Hopefully there's not too much unpaved climbing. That's not my favorite. Morning. Gradual climbs. Okay. It's very, very pretty through the forest. At some point, there's an end to climbing, right? Columbus. This is a beautiful section of trail. Wow.
Thank you kindly. On your left. Thank you. Behind me is a topiary recreation of George Seurat's uh, famous painting. You might know it from Sunday in the Park with George or from art history or other places. My spouse Ilana had one request of me uh, as long as I was going this week away into Ohio. And that was while I was in Columbus to stop at this very park, something that she and her friend uh, found on their road trip. And I had to sing at least a little bit of Sunday in the Park with George. Now, there are all sorts of lawn equipment and everything going on, so hopefully this will work, but here we go. Sunday in the park with George. There are worse ways to spend a Sunday. Sunday in the park with George. Okay, and that's quite enough of that. But I just, I think it's really cool. I'm really glad that Ilana told me to come out here and check it out. This particular view is about as accurate to the painting as uh, you can get. I love seeing some of the details. The more I look at it, the more I see. Like in the background, you might be able to make out some sailboats made out of wire. Of course, uh, we've got other things going on here too. Um, all the different topiary things to look right from the one angle. And then uh, they had to fi figure out how to make the rest of them look. Fortunately, they're mostly people shaped and round, but a fantastic Fantastic thing. Ooh. This is the painting from the reverse. So I am so grateful to be with my family tonight, have a warm place to stay and have amazing rigatoni and food and, fr and family all together. This is so good. Mm -hmm. Cheers. I'm gonna make it all the way around here. Cheers. Yay.